Kyle? Yes, Jack. Old people are nuts. My grandpa used to dip his socks in his own tea. We all know alumni have crazy stories, which is why we're going to be asking them about their glory days. Come on. Okay, so we're out here on the, the University of Florida's campus asking questions about the heydays, you know, about the glory days when we're in school, because we all know we that were college... We just talking about them. Oh, well, what were you guys just talking about? <laughs> when did you go to school? 1977 to uh, 1981. How were things back in the day? Not back in the day, excuse me, but back then when you went to school. Uh, well, it was really, really hot and we lost a lot of games. What was we lost every single game. Yeah, every game. Were things as crazy as they are now back then? Yeah. <laughs> it seems more organized now. <laughs> I mean, all was way rowdy back then? Yeah, definitely way rowdier. What kind of guy were you in college? I was wild, man. I was real wild. Do you have any crazy stories of when you went to school? I don't. You know, I studied a lot, and it, grad school is definitely different than undergrad. But We used to yell down in the toilets to the girls that were uh, below us and stuff like that, and they'd scream back up at us, you know, and then we'd, you know, come up there after, you know, 10 minutes or so. And What was so memorable? What, what sticks out to you when you think back to college? Like, oh, my God, I, mean, I, I missed this. I really get into all the details, oh, yeah. but I had an oh, awesome threesome one time. Was, what was your number in college? The wall of shame number or the, the other number? Both. I'd say about 35, I think we're thinking. What's your fondest memory of college? Probably Mr. Two Bits. How was it walking the campus as the homecoming queen? Actually, um, nobody really knew I was because um, that's not something you identify with. But in my heart, I felt proud because I represented my sorority, Kappa Delta. I was president. Were you in a fraternity? I am Delta Upsilon. And, uh, it was great. We were number one fraternity on the campus. Katie was, um, I, I gotta be honest with you, it was the best sorority on campus. Uh, I was head cheerleader for two years. We had intramural council presidents. We kind of controlled the fraternity system at Ole Miss. All of our girls were well-rounded. We were great collegiate women. We were not only beautiful, but we were very smart. We were social, and um, they've all gone on to have terrific careers. Our two toughest decisions at Ole Miss that I ever made was who is going to be my cheerleader partner my junior and senior year? And very difficult decision, but I chose Miss Mississippi my junior year and the Maid of Cotton my senior year. Do you have a story that you haven't told your mom yet? Oh my God. There were a couple of episodes with alcohol pre-20, age 21. Definitely some classes that I, I flunked out of that she doesn't know about. Their favorite line was, what we don't know won't hurt us. What could you say to the kids who are going into school right now? Enjoy it because it's uh, it's nothing but fun. You got to make the best of it. There are ups and downs over the years, but it's mainly up. Just enjoy it. Have a great time. Fucker right in the pussy. <laughs>